Hey, I'm Cameron McKenzie, editor of the serverside.com, and I wanted to show you how to delete a folder from a Git repo. Here's the spoiler alert. It's git rm double dash cached folder name, but there's some fine details, so stick around. As you can see, I've got my GitHub repository here with folder one and folder two in it, and I've got my local repository here with folder one and folder two in it. It's just a .keep file inside of them, but there is something inside of them. And let's say I wanted to start off by deleting folder number two. How could I do it? Well, git provides this rm command and also a recursive option you can throw on it. And you can use this to delete, delete folders and everything in them. So I'll just do git rm-r folder two. Do a git commit. And then git pushed origin. And wouldn't you know it, everything is done. The video is over, nothing more to talk about. There you go, it's deleted. However, we deleted the folder in the Git repo, but we also deleted the folder from the file system. Now, a lot of times people that want to delete the folder from Git don't want to delete it from the file system as well. They want to keep it as an untracked folder with untracked files in the file system. So how do you do that? Well, that's where the Git RM cached command comes in. So you do git rm double dash cached dash r recursively and then the name of the folder which will be folder one and watch this magic. Folder one is deleted uh, along with the git keep file that was inside of it but it's only deleted from the git repo. It's not deleted from my file system. So if I do a git commit and get pushed origin, well, here's your proof that that folder is deleted in Git. The push deleted it over in GitHub, but that file and folder is still there on my file system. And you can see it's untracked. It is now an untracked folder, but it is indeed still there. So there you go. That is the trick. If you want to delete a folder from your Git repo and you want to delete it from the file system, it's git rm double dash cached. But if you want to leave it on your file system as an untracked folder with untracked files, do the git rm double dash cached folder name command. And by deleting only the cache, it won't delete it on your file system. Might want to add the dash r recursive option in there too.